What's up guys, Adam Middlesworth here. Welcome to my YouTube channel and in today's video, I'm gonna show you the best Facebook and Instagram ads for real estate agents and mortgage loan officers this year. All right guys, so we're gonna go through exactly what you can do to generate leads and some even more complex strategies into how you can go and follow up with leads as well. So uh, in Creative Hub here, I've basically outlined the exact ads that we use for our real estate agents and mortgage loan officer clients. These ads have been used by over 4,000 agents um, and, and multiple hundreds of mortgage loan officers. So these work really, really well. We use these both for real estate agents and mortgage loan officers. So all of you loan officers who don't have a listing, make sure that you uh, kind of pay attention to what I'm talking about here. So um, in this first ad, we're doing a coming soon ad. So if you're a real estate agent and you have a listing coming soon, you just need the uh, image of the home, right? You just need one image. You don't have to have all the images of the home. As long as it's a really good quality image of the front of the home, you can do this ad campaign, right? And what's cool is this isn't going to be on Zillow. It's not on Realtor.com. It's not on Trulia. So literally, this is the only place that they can get it, right? Which that is a huge value because a lot of times, uh, a lot of objections from real estate agents is, well, they can just see this on Zillow, Realtor.com. Well, this, they truly can't. It's literally the only place that they can receive that information. So we're just going to say coming soon. This is a pre-listed, not seen on Zillow, Realtor.com, Trulia yet, right? It's a beautiful home, blah, blah, blah. You're basically going to make that an attractive, uh, attractive statement about the home. And then they're just going to click the link below to get information before anyone else can, right? Once they click this, uh, I would recommend doing either a lead form, basically a lead generation, or a conversion campaign. Uh, I will link in the description below how to do lead forms uh, and how to do conversion campaigns. <clears throat> so this is essentially uh, the very first ad that people will see from you. And then from here, what you can do is retargeting. For every campaign that you do, you should do a retargeting ad or not, a, not even just one, two, three, four retargeting ads for every ad that you put out in your area. Because if they see this and they're interested and they click, then we want to go. We want to take them through that cycle of uh, they want to see you time and again with this listing or other listings or homes lists or lending campaigns, right? So this is the first ad that I would highly recommend using. And then on the second one, what I'd recommend using is either an open house or a price reduction, whatever you have going on about that listing that you that you previously used, you'll retarget them with this ad. Right, so if it's a, a pre-listing, then you can say, "Oh, this was just listed." Or if it's just listed, then you have an open house coming up. You can say, "Oh, I have an open house coming this Sunday," or whatever it is, right? Or if you have a price reduction, you can say, "Hey, this home has been reduced by X amount, right? Save a thousand, ten thousand dollars by you know buying this home now, kind of thing, right?" So this is the second ad that I would highly recommend. Uh, and it's price reduced and then the same statement and then tap below to see price more photos of this property And in this one if you've already acquired the lead then you can do what's called a messenger ad Which is a JSON ad. It'll take them right into messenger uh, I'll link in the description below how to do a messenger ad. It's called a JSON ad It's a little bit more complex, but if you've already acquired the lead you don't need their name and email, right? So we want to take them in through messenger and then the last that I recommend doing is a lending type campaign. So a lot of objections that you hear from your clients and people who are looking to buy a home, they don't have 20% down for a home, right? So would you buy if you only had to put down 3%, right? See if you qualify for our special financing programs. And if they're interested and they don't have 20% down, uh, but they do want to buy in the next year, they're going to click on this ad, right? So this ad can be to a cold audience or to a warm audience. So a warm audience example would be you do the pre-listing, you do a price reduction, and then you do a 3% down. So that's kind of the sequence they would see the ads in, right? They would see the pre-listed first, 
Basically, you're selling them the dream of a home. And then the second would be a price reduction or an open house. Uh, and then the third would be a lending campaign, right? Whether it's zero down, uh, down payment assistance, whatever you have going on, uh, FHA, conventional, really whatever campaign that is working or whatever home loan is working best in your area at the time, you're going to know what's best for your clients. So that's kind of the sequence of events that I would use for the absolute best Facebook and Instagram ads for real estate agents and mortgage loan officers. I have a ton of more videos, guys. I'll link those in the description below. How to do real estate campaigns, how to do mortgage campaigns, how to set up the messenger ad, how to set up lead forms. I'll link all those in the description below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you guys want to see more videos, I come up with a new video every single week on real estate lead generation, mortgage loan officer lead generation, and all things digital marketing. All right, guys, so I will see you guys in the next video.